Okay, in this video you're going to learn how to download a new project and uh, put it in the proper folder so that you can work on it. You should be able to get to this um, screen. This is just a login to Edmodo and uh, you should go to the programming enrichment web page. Go to the folders and you should see um, different projects. Now as the quarter moves on you'll see more and more projects uh, but today we're going to be downloading data basics so project 2 data basics click on it and you'll see some files uh, what we're going to do is we're going to download the data basics zip file a zip file is a bunch of files compressed into one um, one folder so just uh, click on it and it asks you to download it it really doesn't matter which one um, you pick, uh, I'd like you to open with Archive Utility because that saves you some, um, some work later on. So open with Archive Utility and press OK. And you should, you should see something um, bounce down over there, but don't worry about that. OK, um, you've downloaded it, you're done, you can close out everything. And, um, well, I skipped a step there. Um, go to your desktop and then go to what's called the Finder and click on the Finder and you're going to go to a folder called Downloads. That's the folder that keeps everything that you download on uh, this computer. So click it and you should see the file databasics zip which is one of the files that you downloaded but you should also see a folder called databasics. This is the compressed file and that archive utility that you used decompressed it to this nice little folder. So what you want to do is you want to drag this folder to the desktop and just drop it there. Boom. All right, then you can close that. Then you want to take code bucket enrichment and you want to open that up. And it's as simple as this. You just take data basics and you drop it into projects. Boom. Well, that was a little odd. You don't really need to do all that. Uh, you can open up projects and you can drop it in like this. Boom. And now, um, I mean, you don't have another project, but uh, these are all the projects that are in my project folder. So I close that. I open up Code Bucket. And sure enough, when I go to load projects, Data Basics is there waiting for me. Boom. And it's as simple as that. Let's see if you can follow all those instructions. Okay, good luck.